welcome everyone to my channel called educational talk and today i am here with a new video called csrf token field or forbidden 403 error so most of you whenever you are trying to call an api or have or trying to call an ajax call we you all must have faced this issue forbidden 403 so basically basically i am using django as a backend service and uh, I'm trying to integrate one uh, Ajax here in my data, data table. Okay, but that uh, Ajax data is not uh, not able to load that Ajax data to my HTML template. If you see, if I refresh this page, and I'm calling an Ajax uh, function here, it's saying processing, and I'm able to see this particular alert. Data table warning, table ID, data, data table one, Ajax error for more information about this error. Okay, so you can, go more, you can go and visit this particular URL for more information. And if I say, okay, so my data is basically not loading. Although my Ajax call is happening, if I go to my local server, if you see here, so multiple times uh, the URL or the Ajax call is happening, but it's not successful. It's giving me 403, basically forbidden error. If I, also, I can also show you from my inspect element, if you see here, beneficiary API call is happening, but it's saying 403 forbidden error. And this is a post request I'm trying to make. I'm trying to call this particular Ajax to list my data table data. If I go to preview, you, uh, here it's saying CSRF to a verification field. Okay, so what is CS, CSRF? C, uh, basically, CSRF is your uh, cross site request forgery. So whenever you make any kind of request form in terms of your web development or in terms of your form, uh, every time we send one, uh, we need to send one token whenever we do a post request to a particular form. So in order to authenticate a particular user. So this is kind of a, uh, due to a security reason, we need to send a CSR of token for each request made. So that's why here I'll show you my code also in my HTML template. So basically, I'm trying to call uh, this particular Ajax format data table. So this is the format. This is the my. This is the ID of my uh, data table, and I'm saying processing true, server side true, and I'm calling this particular Ajax here. If you see, and the type is post. But when I try to load the page, the post request is written, but it's not successful. And even in the response, it's coming 403 forbidden error. So now you understood like why this error is coming because I'm making a call, but I'm not sending a, a CSR of token in, in uh, when I'm, I'm trying to call this particular uh, Ajax. So what you need to simply do, uh, the in the place we are basically are calling your Ajax, there you need to, okay, I, just comment, I have just commented this line. I'll just uh, uncomment it. Okay, so you need to call, you need to send one more parameter data. There you need to send a CSRF middleware token. So this will be a key for your uh, uh, CSRF token. And value I'm sending is CSRF token. So here, this value, but basically I'm generating in line number 206, where CSRF token equals to get cookie CSRF token. So to generate a CSRF token for my um, Ajax call, I'm using this get cookie function which I have defined uh, in the top. And if you see there, get cookie, I'm passing a name. And basically, I'm generating one uh, particular, uh, I'm generating one CSR of token, and I'm returning the CSR of token, basically. And passing the same when I'm doing an Ajax call. Okay, so now I have uncommented this particular uh, line. And I'm sending uh, the CSR of token also for each request that I'm making now. Let's see if this works or not. I save it. And I go to my uh, you, uh, browser now. I refresh my page. It's showing pending. See now, you, if you're now, you will be able to see the status code as 200. So basically, now I'm able to access my Ajax, and it gave me a successful response. If you see also in response, I'm able to see the response. Records total, drawn uh, data, and uh, even my listing is coming now. See, before it was not coming, it was giving 4043 error. But after processing, the data is coming here. 
so basically i'm, I'm able to successful call my ajax call my uh, html so the main thing was you need to send whenever we do any kind of a post request in html template uh, for an ajax call or for an api you always need to send a csr token along with your uh, parameters so i hope uh, you understood like why uh, what was the main uh, cause of 404 forbidden error and uh, i will also share this particular code in my description so you can go and have a check on that so so that's it guys uh, i hope you have learned something new today Okay, so whenever you uh, face this kind of uh, this uh, 403 forbidden error, so you need to make sure like you're sending the CSR of token for each uh, AJAX request that we're making. Okay, th uh, thank you. Thank you, everyone.